Property rights are often described as a bundle of sticks, with each stick representing a different right or interest in the property. A party can possess legal title to land, but another party may reserve mineral rights or have an easement permitting access. In Winters v. United States, the Supreme Court had to decide whether the reservation of land to an Indian tribe included the stick of water rights. In 1888, the United States government set aside a tract of land in the Montana Territory for the Grovan and Assiniboine Indian tribes, called the Fort Belknap Indian Reservation. The reservation was mostly arid and required large amounts of water for irrigation to make the land productive. The primary source of water was the Milk River, which bounded the reservation to the north. Henry Winters and other individuals and corporations constructed dams, reservoirs, and canals upstream, diverting much of the water from the Milk River. The United States, acting as trustee for the tribes, sued, claiming that the diversion of the water was illegal because the reservation of land to the tribes implicitly included a reservation of sufficient water to make the land habitable. The district court granted a temporary injunction preventing excessive diversion of Milk River waters, which the circuit court affirmed and made permanent. The Supreme Court granted cert.